once asked a very successful woman to share her secret with me. She smiled and said to me, I started succeeding when I started leaving small fights for small fighters. I stopped fighting with those who have gossiped about me. I stopped fighting with my in-laws. I stopped fighting for attention. I stopped fighting to meet people's expectation of me. I stopped fighting for my rights with inconsiderate people. I stopped fighting to please everyone. I stopped fighting to prove they were wrong about me. I left such fights for those who have nothing else to fight. And I started fighting for my vision, my dreams, my ideas, and my destiny. The day I give up on small fights is the day I started becoming successful and so much more content. Some fights are not worth your time. Choose what you fight for wisely. A good friend of mine found it on Facebook Marketplace and shared it with me because it describes me at so many points of my life and hope it helps you as well because it definitely helped me. Good morning guys, I hope all of you are doing well but we are here with yet another project. I'm going to go ahead and refinish, this is a custom piece for uh, a lady that reached out to me from Facebook Marketplace and we're going to be painting it and beautiful emerald green color which I'm super excited about but let's go ahead scuff sand all over before we prime it because we know it's better to do that so the paint has some more to adhere to remove all the hardware since we're not keeping any of that and transform this piece and of course I'm tagging you along because you guys love it I'm just kidding I do though <laughs> this is what the piece looks like before it's cute but we can modernize it and make it look more vintage. We got the three. I started by using 150 grit sandpaper on the edges where I cannot reach with the sander and eventually I graduate to sander on the areas where I can reach. I definitely feel under the weather today. I don't know what it is. Yesterday morning I woke up and I just like, yeah, you know like when you just feel it but it came in so sudden that kind of, you know, it kind of drove me nuts. It's supposed to snow. I wonder if it's like before snow, change of what drastic change of weather. I don't know. It's just not fun, especially when you're a mom getting sick. It's not at all fun. So we're gonna be using remainder of kills three. How's the weather where you guys are at? Because here it's been actually this last week in Chicago area it's been like really nice like we had a couple days in 60s it's been wonderful but um, it flurried a bit today and now it's like look at that let me show you looking like nothing ever has happened speaking of I need to get some chicken feet see looks like nothing happened in the yard I'm gonna have to fill one of the holes in. The previous hardware came in with extra hole spot, which is fine, not a big deal. Um, but that extra hole spot I gotta fill and sand it, of course. So we gotta work on that a bit. We're just wiping down all the debris and filling up that extra hole that came in with previous hardware. Using Kills 3, we're going to go ahead and prime up the whole dresser. I know you can see I already started, but here's just the top. Sometimes, you know, it's annoying to watch the whole thing uh, being primed. But um, after we finish priming, I'm going to go ahead and send down the drawers now that they're dry and get them ready for priming. Look at that greenery. This is the color we're gonna be using. It's by Bear, it's called Equilibrium. Let's 
go ahead and start because now everything is primed and nice and dry. It's been like probably like at least 12 hours. I would say 16. Now I'm just applying enamel paint in satin finish by Bear in the color is called Equilibrium all over the dresser. So now the three coats of pink and it is done. Let's go ahead and then put the hardware on. Now I'm putting on the brass hardware that my client picked out and I bought it on Amazon and I will definitely link the one down below. It looks so beautiful with the green color. Alright, don't look at me, look at this beauty, okay? I will show you all the details of it in a bit. But, <laughs> um, Still under weather, but my goodness, this thing turned out gorgeous. Why is there flying here? It's freezing. But guys, it's staging time. Let's go ahead and stage this baby together. <laughs> yes, I always use this mirror, but it goes with everything. You see this? Can't have nice things. My children paint everything. I always love putting an open page book. So pretty. Alright, let's take a few photos of it. If I find my phone. Do you remind what it looked like before? And what it looks like now? This piece turned out so good and I'm in love with it and so is my customer. But thank you guys so much for watching. Please don't forget to like, comment, share and subscribe and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!